Today you're going to learn how to add notes and comments inside Geometry Notes, so you can add more information to understand what's going on in Geometry Notes. So let's see. So for example, let's go to Geometry Notes, create something. I'm going to hide this panel and let's use a simple grid. Let's connect it here. Let's select this view. And let's delete half of this grid with the light geometry. And let's use in selection a gradient texture in linear. So if you want to remember how this works, what you can do is select this and press Ctrl Shift left click and connect this here to see the mask. So basically this selection in the light geometry is selecting what is higher, greater than zero. So basically everything that is gray and white. So if it's being selected, it's being deleted as you can see. So maybe I want to remember this information for the future. So how we can do that to create a note here. I'm going to delete this. So first of all, the thing we have to do is to open a new tab. I'm going to click and drag here and select the text editor to create notes, comments, whatever you want. Now to create a note, click here in new, and now we can start writing something. So I'm going to press intro and write something simple like black equal not delete, white equal delete. Or you could write something like greater than zero delete. Okay, so we have this note and here you have the name of the note. So I'm going to write, for example, note one. And now if you want to add this information or whatever you write here, here, what we have to do, first of all, is to go to Add, Layout, and select Frame. And leave it here. And now what we want is this information inside this frame. So how we do that? Select the frame, like right now, as you can see, and press N. And go to Note. And here, in Text, we can add inside the frame any text that we created. So just go here and select the note that we create, note one. And now as you can see inside the frame, we can see this text. If you cannot see it well, what you have to do is to expand the frame from one side or the other. And if you want, you can increase or decrease the size of the text here. You can make it smaller or bigger. If you are blind, then make it bigger. And if you want to change the color, by the way, there is something that is really annoying for me, is that if you go to the corner, you cannot expand both sides at the same time, as you can see. I don't know why they don't add this, but I hope in the future they fix this problem. So if you want to change the color, just go here, enable this, open this tab, and select a new color. For example, I'm going to select red. You can make it brighter or darker. So this is how you create notes common. And for example, if I want to connect this with this, what you can do is to drag this inside of the frame. However, when we do that, the text is being hidden. And if you try to expand this, you cannot do it. So how we fix this problem? To fix this, you need to go here in a string, because this option, when it's enabled, what those basically is to adapt the size of the frame to the size of the node. So we don't want that, so let's disable this. And now we can expand again this frame. So if I expand it like this, I can see again this text. You can move this a little bit. And now I can remember that this node, the selection, when it's black, it's not being delayed, as you can see here. And when it's white, it's being delayed. So you can create as many nodes as you want. If you want to create more nodes, what you have to do, let's come back here and click here, new text. And now we have another node. So we can write node two and write something here. So I have this node. And now if I want to change it, the only thing I have to do is to select again the frame, remember, really important, and go here and select the node two. As you can see, it's really easy to change between different nodes. So now you know how to create comments, notes, to add more information to remember how the notes work. So if you like this video, give a like, subscribe, and see you in the next video.